Good morning. Good morning. So thank you for dropping me off to work. Anytime. Okay, so now's your chance. Go for it. Now's my chance. I offered yeah. you this morning. What about, I mean, we can't do it here. We should go back in the elevator. No, just stop. No, no. I'm talking about Bianca. Go and convince her to move to Paris. No, no, yes. no. That's been settled. No, we called a truce. Ah, Spike. We agreed we're not going to interfere in her love life. Come on, Zach, please. You know... I'm, I'm really serious. I want to go back to the Paris office. Just like that. I've been giving this a lot of thought. Hmm? I need it right now. I... I still have a whole life back there, and Miranda, she misses school, she misses her friends, she loves it there. What about Zoe? Zoe? Um, Zoe's doing a CD in London. London, England? <laughs> oh, well, I, I heard a tale of um, a tunnel between, between England and France makes travel very convenient. <laughs> really? You don't say? Yeah. I'll get the paperwork started. Oh, my gosh. Paris will be happy Thank to Thank you. <gasps> but, Kendall, I'm just a little bit concerned. She's made a pretty deal about my being here, working at Fusion, about Moran and Spike growing up together. I don't know how she's going to take this. Uh, I'll break it to her. I understand. Paris, it's a chaos. It's a mess there. I, I doubt it's a mess. No, I... it is. And if, if I could send anybody else, I would. But it has to be you. And the sooner you leave, the better. I don't know, Zach. This is a no. You do huge know, you, um, Kendall. Please I, talk I, to your sister. I, I need her to go. Okay. Yes. All right. Uh, thanks. Listen, I, I would miss you so much. I would, and so would Spike. But Zach needs you more. And Paris needs you. So if this is what you have to do, then I'm gonna have to live with it. Well, if that's the way you feel, no, I do. It is definitely. Whew. Well, then I. Yes, I'll go. Good. Oh, God. <laughs> okay. Oh, I miss you so much already, but you're making the right decision. You really are. And if there's anything I can do, I mean, can I help you pack or something? Uh, uh, maybe. I don't know. I'll let you know. I think okay. right now I better go tell Mom. Yeah, should I come with you? If I need reinforcements, I'll call. Okay, good. Good. All right. Good luck. <laughs> You did it. <laughs> you did it. You're the best. Your appearance on my show. So what made you change your mind about asking Bianca to go to Paris? Oh, I thought about what you said about your sister's happiness, and I think she deserves the best. And if you think Paris is it, we'll try it. I am so on to you. You are. <laughs> I am. You asked Bianca to go to Paris for me. You did. Admit it. Admit it. You loved me so much you couldn't say no. You just, you broke down. You broke right down. Oh, you... There's news about your father. We tried to keep... Your hospital. I'll, I'll notify you when it happens. I'm, I'm gonna catch up with Bianca. So, I, I know my mom's gonna freak out when she hears that she's leaving, so I'm gonna go help her. Hey. Okay. Come here. There's nothing to worry about. Okay. Keep you posted on whatever I find out. I don't really care where my father goes, as long as it's someplace where he can't hurt people anymore. Man, I wish I could get my head where you are. Every time I see him, hear the name, it all comes back. I mean, he killed women, a cop. He almost killed my daughter. I wanted to watch Alex Cambius take a needle and go straight to hell. And he may still. But I'm not going to waste my life waiting for that to happen. The City of Light. La Vie Lumière. What could be more perfect? <laughs> um, I don't know. Visits from a friend? How do you feel about London? It's my new sec second favorite city. You'll both be so busy working. Not that busy. Look, there's this fabulous Indian restaurant in Chelsea. You'll love it. And have you ever been to the Musée d'Orsay? Fabulous. And afterwards, <laughs> Le Trumilou. Yeah. You haven't dined until the cat tried to steal your food. <laughs> She's got a thing for venison. Oh, that doesn't even sound sanitary. Are you sure you want to do this? Yes. 
be, it must be nice to be able to move on. Yeah. Oh, I'm, I'm sorry. Excuse me, Hannah. I have to kill my husband. Zach told me you were expecting. All the best. Thank you. Hi. Hi, husband of mine. You, my love, are a liar. What I do now? What I do now. Okay, that little show that you put on with Bianca at Fusion. You know, when you pressured me into making her move to Paris to make me happy. Uh-huh. She wanted to go all along for Zoe, and you what? knew it. What? Nothing. You knew it. See? You look so <laughs> guilty. You knew it. Sonny, it ain't too smart to mess with your wife. You want to know why? Because you could end up wearing cement shoes. Oh, OK. So should I sleep with one eye open? You, you're going to be mad at me for a long time, or? No. No. Not too long. Oh, God, that's good. That's good. It's good. <laughs> that's good. Yeah, I guess I, uh, I have to be careful what I wish for now, huh? Yeah. You may kiss me. I may? Mm-hmm. Uh, all right. I guess I will. Mm -hmm. Is that good? Mm-hmm. What are you going to do now? 